Hello, Tim Alex here with the Tim Alex Realty Group at Keller Williams Realty Sioux Falls. Today I am here to bring to you a virtual showing for a gorgeous new listing at 2709 South Rutgers Avenue. Rutgers Avenue is located just uh, northwest of the intersection of 41st Street and Sertoma Avenue. Um, so fantastic Southwest location. This home, 2709 South Rutgers Avenue, is a walkout ranch, four bed, three bath, triple garage, floor drain in the garage, stunning features throughout this home. It was built in 2005 with really nice quality amenities throughout, and it has been absolutely meticulously maintained. Um, I think when I take you through this virtual showing, you're going to be impressed with the features, the layout, the natural light is amazing throughout the home. Um, it has a beautiful fenced in backyard. And another added bonus, this property backs up to a uh, greenway in the backyard. So you've got really nice backyard neighbor separation. Uh, fantastic updates, the front and the 10 by 20 big back deck were recently updated just a couple of years ago with a uh, composite timber tech decking. So high-end decking should never have to stain it in your entire life. Um, really, this one's got a fantastic master suite with a beautiful trade ceiling, um, jacuzzi tub in the master suite, enormous family room downstairs, which I'll show you as we get into the virtual showing. In fact, there's an extra window down in that family room, so a fifth bedroom could be added uh, if so desired. Um, so with these virtual showings, my intention is to take you through the home and point out details, show you the floor plan, just as I would with the standard in-person showing. So um, these do come out to be uh, pretty close to a half an hour by the time we're done with them, but um, if you physically cannot make it out to the home, I want you to be able to see the home and its features and, uh, and upgrades just as though you were walking through the home. Don't mind the grandfather clock beeping at us there, chiming at us. Um, so I'll take you through every aspect of the home inside and outside. I'll pan around um, and, and really just go through everything. As always, if there is anything that you feel that I missed throughout this process, I think you'll discover that I'm pretty thorough in the process. But if you feel there is anything I missed, um, at the end of this video, we'll have my contact information, but I'll just run through it right now as well. My name again, Tim Alex with the Tim Alex Realty Group at Keller Williams Realty. And my cell phone number is 605-759-3996. You can call me, you can text me. My email is tim at timalex.com, two L's and Alex. And there's even a contact us uh, button on our website, which is yoursufallshome.com. So feel free to reach out in any of those methods. And uh, you can hit us on Facebook. We're, we're pretty much everywhere. So whatever we can do to help. Um, any questions, any, anything else that you would like to see. And at this time, we are able to uh, still do in-person showings as well. So if you would like one of those, please contact me, contact me and we can make that happen also. Thank you so much. We'll go ahead and get started with the virtual showing. Um, I'll take you through the house room by room, show you closets, uh, really show you every feature of the home. And then we'll come back after the virtual showing tour and wrap up with an outro. Thank you so much. So we're gonna get started on the virtual showing at 2709 South Rutgers Avenue. I will back up just a little here so you can see the entire front of the home. So beautiful front curb appeal. Beginning of April, it's only April 6th here today. So uh, in South Dakota, not everything is greened up. You will see nice triple garage. Great landscaping. And this will be much better, of course, when the weather changes and everything starts to green up. Nice bushes out front. There is, and I'll show you out back as well, there is a beautiful uh, composite timber tech deck out front, storm door on the front door. We'll just kind of start by doing our tour outside. I will show you up and down the street. This is a great neighborhood, great neighborhood. 
Got a big, uh, big spruce tree, pine tree over here to the north. Giving you some nice separation. Swing over this direction. Really nice homes. And I don't know if you can see, Rutgers is not a very long street. It goes just about two more blocks to the south and a few more to the north, but it's definitely not a through street for most people. Sorry if you hear some wind noise, I'm trying to minimize that. In Sioux Falls, South Dakota, we usually end up with some wind. So out back here, Got a really nice fenced in yard. Again, great landscaping throughout. See some paver edging here. Got some beautiful blue spruce trees. Definitely want to point out that this is a walkout home. So you've got nice patio space underneath and the deck up top. Again, this back deck, 10 by 20 deck, timber tech decking updated just a couple of years ago. So fantastic composite deck, should never have to stay in this deck. Very low maintenance, high quality decking. So there is your lower level walkout. Got a patio right outside. Great neighborhood out back. You see beautiful backyard. There's a coated chain link fence going all the way around. And also another fantastic feature of this, of this property is the greenway in the backyard. It gives you fantastic separation between your backyard and the neighbors. So I will walk back up this direction. Take you over to the other side for April 6th. We certainly have a gorgeous day here. Um, upper 60s, is gonna be a beautiful day. So I'll take you over to the other side, the north end of the home. You have another tree and another gate to get to the backyard. So let's go inside. These both overhead doors were recently updated with uh, the top panel having glass so you get nice light coming into the garage. And there was also a grate cut in that the downspout feeds into so you don't end up with all that ice buildup on that corner as is typical. Also on the garage, there is a pass-through door coming out to the front sidewalk. So we'll go inside here, slip off my shoes. So you'll see the beautiful front door, final front door. I guess fiberglass would be at more accurate. So show you the living room here. Big arch top window that you probably saw from the front as well. Really fantastic, soft, updated carpeting in this room. They upgraded the pad, so it's very nice and, and cushy. Beautiful arch top window. Neat ceiling de detail as well. I always called these an inverted vault or a double vault. So you see the recessed lighting in the vaulted ceiling, and that vaulted ceiling gives you this nice trapezoid um, uh, transom window as well. There is an opening above this wall. So you'll see really open when you first walk in the front door, very inviting entryway. Beautiful Brazilian amendium floors go throughout the kitchen, the dining room, and down the hallway. 
Here you see the nice open railing. Home was built in 2005, so uh, beautiful wrought iron balusters. And you've got the big chunky newel post, the big square newel post. I love those. Plenty of space in the dining room. There are currently six chairs at this table, um, but you've got plenty of additional room to stretch out that table for larger gatherings. So I'll kind of show you how the kitchen and the dining room flow right into each other. So this kitchen is absolutely gorgeous. It has maple cabinets, stainless steel appliances. You've got some nice corner cabinet accents with the glass in the door. One on each corner here to each side of the microwave. Staggered cabinets, beautiful crown molding on the upper staggers. Huge pantry cabinet here, and that pantry cabinet has pullouts in it in the lower portion of the pantry cabinet. Nice side by side refrigerator with ice and water in the door. Lots of countertop space here. And the flat top electric range. Got a beautiful updated faucet with the faucet pull out makes it very easy for washing dishes got a soap dispenser right there in big deep bucket stainless lazy susans in all three corners so right next to the big drawer stack here there's a lazy susan in that corner lazy susan here stainless steel dishwasher and I'll spin you around, another Lazy Susan there. And this window is really nice. It's a deep well window. Little bump out window. Beautiful custom uh, window coverings throughout this home as well. So those little added touches, you can move right in. You've got this great double tiered breakfast bar area. Get a couple of stools up to that bar height stools you see that gorgeous floor running throughout here this area also has the big vaulted ceilings again um you've got another trapezoid transom window gorgeous light fixtures recessed lighting in the kitchen just like in the living room so now we are going to pass just out to the deck so I can show you. I'll give you a look at the kitchen here from this angle while I open up the door. So another glass insert accent panel in that cabinet. So here we go out to the deck. Let's try to give you a couple of different views of this deck. It is absolutely stunning, beautiful views. So big 10 foot wide by 20 foot deck. And again, this is composite timber tech decking that was just redone a couple of years ago. So you see they have another big six place table up here and lots of room for additional seating for your grill. This is a walkout, so we're up nice and high. You can see lots of privacy from the backyard here. Nice backyard separation between, due to that greenway between this home and your backyard neighbor's home. So we will head back in, take a look at this view. So you can see how this lays out. You've got your kitchen. I'm standing in the corner of the dining room living and front entry. So now I'll spin around backwards, take you into the master suite. So one of the first things I like to point out in this room 
It has a beautiful trade ceiling, ceiling fan. And there's lighting, accent lighting up in the trade ceiling. Give you an idea how that looks. It's a nice size master suite here. Just one angle. Like to also point out the six panel solid raised panel doors throughout the home. Take you into the master bath. This master bath has got about everything a person could want. It has a big linen cabinet, full depth, full height linen cabinet. Also, two sinks. So two sinks in the, in the top here. You'll see a nice drawer stack and big cabinet space underneath both of those sinks, onyx top. There is an updated comfort height stool and a beautiful jacuzzi tub for relaxing. Big, beautiful jacuzzi tub. There's also a frosted glass window in this bathroom to get you some nice light coming in. Big mirror. That mirror goes almost the entire width of the vanity top. Nice oil rub bronze fixtures, light fixtures and also updated oil rub bronze plumbing fixtures. Same with on the jacuzzi tub. There is a three quarter shower, or a, uh, excuse me, there is a shower bay in here as well, fiberglass shower bay. And there's a pocket door to close this room from the master. Nice, big, thick, heavy, solid pocket door. So now we'll head into the enormous walk-in closet. Huge, deep walk-in closet. So fantastic storage space in here. You got dual hanging on the two sides, top and bottom, and single hanging out front for your longer items. So there is a very nicely appointed master suite. Lots of space. And on our website, you can find all of the room dimensions. I have far more details on our website, yoursufallshome.com, under featured listings. We've got lots of additional information available there. Uh, great feature of this home. I'm still on the main floor. There are three bedrooms on the main floor. This is the second bedroom. Also has a ceiling fan. Beautiful carpeting in here. Nice big window. And there is a double closet. See those gorgeous six panel doors again. So fantastic bedroom space. And here is the third bedroom. So split bedrooms. The master bedroom is in a different location than the other two bedrooms. This bedroom also has a ceiling fan. Beautiful carpeting. Good size double closet in here as well. Just try to give you another angle of the room. So there's how you access. So three really good size bedrooms all on the main floor. And the fourth bedroom downstairs. We'll get there. We'll get to that. In this bathroom, this is the second main floor bath, also a full bath, big mirror, another top, a molded top with the sink built in, updated faucet, great drawer space on this vanity. You've got drawer stacks on either side of the sink. 
tile flooring, just like in the master. This one has a full fiberglass tub. I'll open this up so you can take a look in. So full fiberglass tub shower combo. Behind the door is a really big linen closet with great storage space, really deep hidden with a pocket door so you can close that. The last room on the main floor I will show you here is the laundry and mudroom. So lots of great features in here. There is a wash basin with the cabinet above. Front load washer and dryer units are staying with the home. Even this room has got ceramic tile. And then to maximize space, there is a huge hanging rod here. This room you can also close with a pocket door. Even the pocket doors in this house are solid six panel doors. Now we'll, take out, take, we'll go out here through the garage door Take a look around the garage. So three style garage, so you can see those natural, the natural light coming in through those updated overhead door, uh, garage doors. You've got openers on both doors, floor drain as well in this garage. So I'll try to give you a couple of different angles. To the right here is the pass-through door going out to the front entry. So you'll see lots of space in this garage. Take you over this direction. So there is the triple garage. This house really checks off the majority of the boxes for most people. Four bed, three bath. You can add a fifth bedroom in the family room downstairs. I'll show you that. Triple garage, walk out home. So I'll show you the stairs here as we go down. Really nice touch on the stairs. You've got the center carpet runner. Sorry if you saw my feet there a little with wood on each side. Big windows in this walkout family room. And you've got a really nice wall of built-ins, custom niches, gas fireplace. Plenty of space down here for your big screen TV. I'll just kind of pan around. So enormous family room. And I, once again, I have the room dimensions for this room on our website. So here's the walk out to the backyard patio. Try to show you the depth of this room from this angle here. Really large family room. It has a beautiful pattern carpet in here. Updated pattern carpet. And the room is also wired for 7.1 surround and these speakers will stay with the home as well. There are three speakers under the television there. There's a subwoofer over kind of hiding in the corner. And you'll see another speaker here. So really enjoying movies down here would be a blast. Feel just like you were in the theater. So I'll give you another angle. So you can see how much space there is in this room. Recess lighting in the ceiling. So this is the area with the additional window there. If a person wanted to add a fifth bedroom, there's already an egress window here. This is the area to me that would make the most sense to add a fifth bedroom if a person so desired. 
The home lays out wonderfully without it, but I just want to show you that as an option. And you would still have a huge family room. So I'll take you, this is under the stair storage right here. Just like to point that out. Take you into the huge fourth bedroom. The current owner uses this as an office. Huge, huge room. Because it's a walkout, you get the big window to get natural light coming in here as well. So really lots of great space. I'm gonna open up this closet also because this closet in this fourth bedroom is a walk-in with double bifold doors. So huge closet in this fourth bedroom, which is located in the lower level. Great closet space there. Now, take you into the third bathroom. You'll see you've got a nice linen closet right here. Tile floors on the floor. You've also got that solid surface vanity top with the updated oil rub bronze faucet. Again, two sets of drawer stacks, one on each side. Oil rub bronze vanity light. And this one is also a full tub shower combo. Oil up Rodden's faucet and valves inside here. I'll just give you another view of this bathroom. So the floor plan in this house is fantastic. Just fits pretty much what everyone is looking for. Plus, on top of everything, you have this mechanical room, unfinished space with lots of great storage. Electrical panel is over on the side wall here. And I have you look back around. Gas water heater. Water heater was updated, if you can see that, in December of 2018. Show you a couple of things here. Has a ream high efficiency furnace. And kind of tucked on the side of the ductwork here, it also has an April air whole house humidifier that is included. So there is the lower level. Give you another angle of those stairs with the carpet runner. And that runner is not a runner that is tacked on top of the stairs. That is built in with, uh, with the wood accents on each side. So now we're back up just at the very top of the stairs to give you a view from the top of the stairs here. Tim Alex here again, I'm back. Um, I thank you for coming and joining us here today in this virtual showing. Um, I've taken you through every room of the house, showed you all of its features and benefits, taken you around the outside of the home so you could really get a feel for the space of the home, for the floor plan, the features and the amenities in the home. Lots of gorgeous upgrades throughout this home. Um, amazing natural light just really saturates the entire home. Big vaulted ceilings throughout. You've got great amenities with the three panel doors, jacuzzi tub in the master bath. Uh, composite timber tech front and rear decks that were recently updated. Um, beautiful maple cabinetry in the kitchen and huge family room downstairs. I could go on and on and on. So just a quick recap. Um, this one is a four bed, three bath, triple garage home, uh, floor drain in the garage. And there are four, it's 1400 square feet on the main floor. 1,184 square feet in the lower level. So just under 2,600 total finished square feet, uh, 2,584. Um, the 
year built is 2005. Um, so nice recent uh, finishes in the home really just shows very well. And I cannot stress enough how meticulously maintained this home is. The current owners have owned this home since 2007. So 13 years of ownership in this home. And the, the maintenance and the care of the home is, is very obvious when you're, when you're looking at this property. Um, even the outside, I know right now it's not, uh, it's not beautiful and green and we don't have things sprouting just yet. It's just the beginning of April in South Dakota right now and our weather's been pretty good, but uh, it's going to take a little bit for everything to green up. So um, the showing quality of the home will continue to improve as the yard and the landscaping and everything comes into uh, full green mode. Um, so. If I missed anything, if you have any questions about the property, if there is anything whatsoever that we can help you with. Um, my name again, Tim Alex with the Tim Alex Realty Group at Keller Williams Realty. My cell phone number is 605-759-3996. You can call me there, you can text me. My email, tim at timalex.com, two L's and Alex. You can contact me through our website as well, uh, yoursufallshome.com. So, if you've made it all the way to the end, I thank you very much for staying tuned in. Um, I assure you this home is just, it's a fabulous layout, beautiful finishes, and I can't stress enough the updates and the meticulous care uh, provided in this home. So I thank you. I wish you a fantastic day and uh, hope to uh, talk to you soon.